As restaurants in Alberta remain closed on provincial orders, a number of owners across the province have had enough and decided to reopen. One of those restaurants is Jenny's Diner in Bonneville. But so many people count on me. I mean, I have a family, I have a mortgage, just like everybody else. Yes, my doors are open for takeout, but my revenue has decreased 85%. My bills haven't. The restaurant had 19 workers before the pandemic. Now it's down to three, and that includes Hamel and her husband. She reopened the doors of her 50s-style diner on Wednesday, not sure what to expect. She says she's received a wealth of backlash from Albertans across the province, but also support. I actually had a lady phone me today from Red Deer, and initially I wasn't sure where the conversation was going to go. 25 minutes later of talking with her, you know, she's just trying to understand. And, you know, I explained how and what we were doing on our end and how we're following protocol. Hamel tells City News an inspector from Alberta Health Services visited the diner Wednesday, raising concerns about social distancing. She explains she's following all health guidelines, but there's no way to enforce distancing. As a human, when I tell you, you can't stand beside your buddy and you need to social distance and you basically tell me where to go, what do I do? Do I now forcibly remove you? Do I phone the cops to have you? I mean, where does it go? We're in a small community. She even received support from local leaders in Bonneville and the mayor of Lac La Biche. Lac La Biche Mayor Omer McGrabby says he made the trek to Bonneville to show support, adding he takes the science of COVID seriously, but says small businesses need help. I'm not encouraging people to, to not listen to the protocols and the directives is just we want the government to look a little closer at uh, some of the suffering some of the small businesses are going the hospitality I mean one in three is going to go under. Hamel says she's not worried about fines saying those can be paid back she's more worried about potentially being shut down and the ramifications of losing her business license. Adding restaurant owners and employees are facing a separate pandemic the mental health toll of being out of work for so long. And that's something that really needs to be addressed and that needs to be put in the forefront just as much as as the, the pandemic. In Edmonton Darcy Ropchan City News.